Welcome to Parks, Programs, and Opportunities. This section is going to be filled with opportunities and programs that you can share with the visitors that come to your parks. Now sit back and listen to the variety of programs that we have to offer in the Genesee County Parks. Parks, programs, and opportunities are so important in our Genesee County Parks because our vision is that Parks bring people together. And our mission is that the Genesee County Parks is dedicated to quality recreational opportunities for everyone and the preservation of natural resources. One of our greatest tools that we have is our great getaway guide. All of you should make sure that you have one on hand it's filled with information about the parks, a map, and addresses to each of the park locations. This is a great start to learning more about the park's facilities and programming opportunities. Another great tool for learning about the Genesee County Parks is our website, geneseecountyparks.org. On there, you will find our calendar of events. It's filled with different types of opportunities and programs for people to enjoy the Genesee County Parks. Make sure to subscribe to the Parks YouTube channel. On there, you'll see that we have different types of educational opportunities, how-tos, and information about the parks. This is a great place to learn about the different opportunities and programming taking place in your parks. Make sure to subscribe. With close to 11,000 acres to explore, we are proud to do our best to provide park opportunities for everyone in our community. That is why, over the next few minutes, we will be doing a quick overview of the many different park facilities, opportunities, and programs that the Genesee County Parks has to offer. Learning about our different park opportunities will allow you to help share and promote our park system. If you would like any more detailed information about any of these park facilities, please visit our website at geneseecountyparks.org or contact the facility directly. Hi everyone, Denise Bowles here, manager of Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad. I'm going to give you a quick overview of Crossroads Village. Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad is a Genesee County jewel that has been in operation for over 44 years. The idea behind Crossroads Village began to take shape in 1967 as a way to save and celebrate historical buildings, mostly from around Genesee County, that were being destroyed to make way for expressways and urban development. Charles Stewart Mott, was instrumental in making the dream of a working farm museum a reality. With the support of many organizations and volunteer groups, Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad opened to the public on July 4, 1976. We like to think that when park visitors walk through our gates that they are instantly transcended to an earlier place in time in the late 1800s. Where else can you find a northern working pioneer village set in the late 1800s that has steam locomotive trains, an historic themed village with 30 plus preserved and restored buildings where artisans demonstrate old world trades such as printing, toy, broom and cider making, saw and grist milling, tin and blacksmithing, and where villagers invite you into their homes. Crossroads Village also has a replica paddle wheel boat 
and beautifully restored and maintained antique Parker carousel and Ferris wheel and other fun rides for your amusement. You can also expect to see a professional entertainer performing each season in the Caldwell Opera House. It is an amazing place, made even more amazing due to the wonderful, caring, talented, and skilled village people. At Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad, they build steam engine locomotive trains that can carry over 450 people. Where else can you find that? At Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad, we have three main seasons, spring and summer, Halloween, and Christmas. We offer a lot of different events and activities during the summer for everyone to experience and enjoy. Two of our most popular seasons are Halloween and Christmas. For the month of October, Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad transforms into a Halloween village with a cool ghost train. We offer a family-friendly program where the whole village is decorated for fun. For Christmas at Crossroads, we open the day after Thanksgiving with a bang and a spectacular fireworks display. The whole village is decorated in a gazillion lights with beautiful holiday displays everywhere you look and up and down the train tracks. Many artists and trades are in full operation along with the trolley ride to take you around the village. You can write a letter to Santa or stop in and see Santa at his workshop. There's plenty of shopping too and you'll find community choirs singing in the chapel. On Monday nights, we offer a special drive through Throughout the whole year, the real magic of Crossroads Village is created by our dedicated and fun village people. Parks bring people together. Come to Crossroads Village and Huckleberry Railroad and see for yourself. Hello and welcome to Formar Nature Preserve and Arboretum. My name is Nicole Ferguson and I'm the head park naturalist here at Formar. When you need to lose yourself in nature's beauty, there's nothing quite like the 383 pristine acres of Formar Nature Preserve in Arboretum. This former dairy farm was donated by Forbes and Martha Merkley in 1970 with support from the CS Matt Foundation. Here at Formar, we have a variety of locations for you to visit. From our visitor center with live and mounted animals to our seven and a half miles of hiking trails, our butterfly house filled with eight different species of butterflies, and our tree house that was featured on the Treehouse Masters from Animal Planet. This is a great place for you to get to explore and share with our visitors. Formar is known for our wide variety of field trip opportunities that we offer year round. Come snowshoeing with us in the winter. Learn how to make maple syrup with us in the spring. Maybe become a nature scientist with your scout group in the summer or visit with a school group field trip in the fall. During all seasons, we have field trip opportunities available for you. Throughout the year, we also offer a wide variety of public programming for youth. From searching for bugs in the pond, to becoming a slime scientist, to looking at the stars with our astronauts. This is a chance for you and your kids to be able to come out and enjoy Form Our Nature Preserve and Arboretum. But don't worry, the programming fun doesn't stop with kids. We also have a wide variety of adult programs. 
Beekeeping 101 and 102 are some of our most popular. We also do a variety of bird watching classes, photography clubs, and full moon hikes. These are a great opportunity for our big kids to get out and enjoy nature as well. Are you or someone you know looking for a volunteer opportunity? Well, look no further. Formar has a huge variety of volunteer opportunities available to our community. From our internships, to our stewardship and garden work days, to becoming a citizen scientist for wildlife, we have the perfect opportunity for everyone to volunteer in the parks. Hey there, Courtney Prout here, Environmental Education Outreach Coordinator at 4MR Nature Preserve and Arboretum. I would like to share the fun of 4MR Outreach with you. 4MR Environmental Educators are here to help bring nature right into your home with short videos and topics as unique as nature itself. You can learn the quick basics of evergreen identification or why moles dig their holes or even learn how to craft a cool creation that also benefits wildlife. Check out the 4MAR Facebook page and the Genesee County YouTube channel for video playlists that will spark your inner naturalist. Want something a little more interactive? Tune in to 4MAR's Facebook page for live virtual programs. Ask a Naturalist or Nature Break Junior are loaded with fun facts, cool triad ideas, and sneak peeks behind the scenes of the Formar Visitor Center. Now, more mobile than ever, Formar is presenting virtual field trips for students in preschool all the way through high school. With interactive digital multimedia slideshows, engaging remote activities, and lessons aligned to state learning standards, Form our virtual field trips will supplement any curriculum. Pictured here are two different slides from two different programs. The one on your left is from Nature's Recyclers, a how-to program about vermicomposting and the three R's, reduce, reuse, recycle. The second on your right is from Nature's Superheroes, an English language arts program that inspires young illustrators and authors to use nature as their main characters. Environmental education can weave a variety of academic subjects into one valuable lesson. A big part of our Formar outreach efforts is our garden exploration space. We hope you have a chance to come out to Formar and explore the gardens. Welcome to Wolverine Campground. If you are looking for a weekend getaway, or a fun summer adventure, this pine tree forest along the Holloway Reservoir offers 199 campsites with a boat launch, walking trails, campground programs, and nearby beach. This is your perfect camping adventure. Reservations start as early as January for this year's camping season. The Genesee County Parks has six different locations that you can launch your boat. Remember, at Bluegill Boat Launch and Walleye Pike Boat Launch, you do need to make sure you have your boat launch pass that you can pick up at the administration building. Have you got what it takes to take on the mounds? Well, there's only one way to find out. At Michigan's premier off-road vehicle facility, the mounds. And what makes the mounds the undisputed king of Michigan off-road facilities? Easy. Every day, all week, all year, all kinds of train, all kinds of vehicles, only at the mounds. If you love going off-road, we've got one of the greatest playgrounds you'll ever find. If you want more information, go to themounds.org. It's your number one source for everything the Mounds has to offer. So whether you've been ORVing for years or you're planning your very first trip, this is the place to go and we've got you covered. The Mounds ORV Park, making grown men cry since 1971. 
Keep Genesee County Beautiful, KGCB, hashtag do beautiful things, is a Ruth Mott Foundation funded initiative that became a program of the Genesee County Parks in 2015. KGCB was created in 2004 with a mis mission to encourage, educate, and engage the community in ongoing cleanup and beautification of Genesee County. Our vision is beautiful, clean, and sustainable neighborhoods, parks, and open spaces for Flint and Genesee County. This is achieved through individual responsibility, volunteer action, and partnerships. KGCB accomplishes this work through the Adopted Park and cultiv Cultivating Our Community programs, supporting community cleanups, and providing information about recycling and household hazardous waste collections. The City of Flint no longer has a Parks and Recreation Department, so city parks are maintained through partnerships, collaborations, and by volunteers. The Genesee County Parks has a formal partnership agreement in place that maintains city parks along the Flint River, Max Brandon Park, Flint Park Lake Park, McKinley Park, and Thread Lake Park. The remainder of city parks are maintained by community residents who volunteer their time to pick up the litter, change out the garbage bags, redistribute playground safety surfacing, and plan and implement free, fun, educational, and recreational programs for their neighbors. Cultivating Our Community is a gardening program that creates beauty, connects neighborhoods, establishes place, and serves a purpose. We're planting monarch way stations and other pollinator gardens, educational gardens, and connecting people to other gardening resources. All these gardens are planted in public spaces that include places like gateways into the city, medians around the city, the Flint Farmer's Market, park entryways, and street corners. Keep Genesee County Beautiful partners with residents and local organizations like the Flint River Watershed Coalition, Genesee County Land Bank, Flint Neighbors United, and the Neighborhood Engagement Hub, who are all working towards the goal of creating cleaner, greener, and more beautiful places to live. For more information about Keep Genesee County Beautiful, visit their website page at geneseecountyparks.org slash KGCB or follow them on Facebook. And let's not forget about our trails. We have miles of outstanding hiking, biking, and kayaking for our community to explore. 65 miles of trail, 20 miles of waterway, and close to 11,000 acres because the Genesee County Parks are for everyone in our community to enjoy because parks bring people together.